problem in Malawi is they don't have a lot of health centers and people aggregate in villages, which are in most cases really far from hospitals or health centers. The implications of that is that mothers would travel a long distance to seek health care after they've already entered labor. And this resulted in higher mortality because they were exhausted by the time they reached the facility or they gave birth on the road. And that's the broader reason why maternity waiting homes were introduced in the country. These are places where mothers would go so they can be followed by a professional who can guide them through their last six weeks of pregnancy and help them deliver safely. Of the maternity waiting homes that have been built in Malawi, usage and performance is lacking. The research suggests that even when maternity waiting homes are available to women, they may be underutilized, in part because of their design. Mothers cite concerns about the lack of privacy, safety, and hygiene. And in addition, the homes are not designed to accommodate the family members who accompany pregnant mothers during their stay. In 2013, Mass Design Group was approached to come and help rethink how these maternity waiting homes were designed. This meant that we not only had appropriate daylighting and ventilation, but we were really focusing on creating comfortable, healthy, safe, and sanitary conditions for these women. We also looked at different ways that design could facilitate interaction. Create an experience that is going to encourage them to come back next time they get pregnant, but also encourage other mothers to go. And this entire project, since its inception, we've approached it from that angle. You want to have a good laugh. You want to have a good laugh.